டிஜிட்டல் டுடே தி டாபிக் இஸ் ஆன் டிஜிட்டல் மொபைல் ரேடியோ ஃபர்ஸ்ட் ஸ்டெப் டு எம்பரேஸ் பீனட் டிஎம்ஆர் வாட் இஸ் டிஜிட்டல் மொபைல் ரேடியோ டிஎம்ஆர் டிஜிட்டல் ரேடியோ மொபைல் இஸ் எ ஷார்ட் ஃபார்ம் ஃபார் டிஎம்ஆர் ஸ்டாண்டர்ட் டெவலப் பை யூரோப்பியன் டெலிகம்யூனிகேஷன் ஸ்டாண்டர்ட் இன்ஸ்டியூட் எச்சி எக்ஸிஸ்டிங் அனலாக் ட்ரங்கிங் ஸ்டாண்டர்ட்ஸ் ரிக்வயர்ட் அப்டேட்ஸ் வித் மாடர்ன் டெக்னிக்ஸ் இம்ப்ரூவ்ட் வாய்ஸ் குவாலிட்டி improved uh, security improved functionality such as location tracing info since uses to slot uh, tdma improved channel uh, effect, efficiency covering voice and data the actually the analog uh, is uh, you know what we are having uh, is uh, goes on a single uh, line but with a digital on a 12.5 it is divided into half say 6.5 6.5 so you are able to transmer transport uh, the data and voice at the same time and two channels we can use so with the uh, introduction of the digital end to end with optical fiber and other connectivity uh, the improved voice quality improved security and improved uh, functionality such as location tracing because we can have aprs and uh, other tracking system gps location etc along with this since uses two slot tdma improved channel efficiency as i mentioned to you there are it uses it can use two channel also covering voice and data both uh, you can do lot of voice and data uh, system what is digital mobile radio it's for part 2 the easy migration path for existing analog radio user so it gives you a very nice uh, uh, move over to the digital without uh, disrupting the analog system it operates within 12.5 kilohertz channel spacing used in licensed land mobile frequency band globally so it doesn't need a extra band facility with the existing they can uh, start using this removes need for time consuming and expensive frequency recycling or special frequency allocation so it is possible to give hybrid analog and digital radios to operate uh, together because most of the radios are coming nowadays with a hybrid system which can operate uh, 2 meters and 70 centimeters as well as the dmr radio dmr provides uh, two channel as against analog one channel okay so i told you about it improved uh, functionality such as location tracing info uh, this is uh, the the aprs is uh, not a gps uh, system to find somebody or something it is a used uh, aprs function is used for uh, in a time when the emergency is there for tracing purpose and location etc okay that is uh, attached to our ham system since uses two slot it may improve channel efficiency uh, covering voice and data it covers both voice and data together so uh, increases uh, in a nutshell increases capacity longer battery life minimum use of infrastructure advanced functionality and control features business critical data application clarity to digital voice for professional radio users so the dmr helps in various industry we can use in medical we can use in radio ships communications etc because the, the uh, it consumes a very less and the transmission also less than 1 kilowatt so the uh, the usage of battery is 3 uh, times or 4 times it increases on the unit what you are going to have and minimum use of infrastructure you don't need a very heavy type of infrastructure to run the dmr setup so we will go on to the uh, there are uh, different uh, protocols like a uh, asu and icom and uh, various other kenwood all those people will have their own uh, sort of a protocol uh, the some of the protocol which you will come across are dmr dstar system fusion nxdn p25 uh, poxac and etc so these are the different type and different company are up to this policy of course there are uh, bridging facilities are available from going from one protocol to another dmr transceiver to access uh, c4 uh, fm and nxdn network uh, with uh, dstar c4 fm receiver transceiver to access dmr nxdn and p25 network for nxdn 
NXT and Transceiver to access a DMRC for uh, network POSC uh, SAC and uh, P25 Transceiver to access uh, C4FM network. Uh, each, uh, this is uh, one of the thing uh, which you find in open uh, spot 2 uh, that gives every set as a cross bridge, uh, you know, facility. If you buy a ASU, you have to check what they give. If you buy Kenode, uh, they only support uh, D-Star, they don't support the DMR. Then we have to go for anything. So over a period of time, uh, now the Chinese uh, sets are there, uh, you know, uh, uh, there are uh, nice uh, sets are coming which support DMR and D-Star and uh, all this uh, uh, together. So as in time goes, I think it will support almost everything with a cross, uh, cross uh, you know, bridge uh, facility. Note the cross, uh, cross mode using D-Star transceiver network is not supported as a D-Star user. This is particularly for one of the set uh, I was handling. So it doesn't support, can not uh, if you take a THD, 74 it is uh, very expensive but uh, being a protocol they support is a d star they don't do dmr so we have to use for a spot uh, hotspot to get a connection between this so i will explain more in my second volume it's a bit technical because we need more time for that today our concentration is to kick start uh, something okay this is the software uh, developed by Mr. David, PA7LIM and this is how uh, after installation the software looks on the uh, blue side what you are looking at and uh, when a call comes it changes color, you know, so you know what is uh, who is talking and his call sign will come and the play, QTH will also show. So the file size of this uh, Microsoft uh, Software is 3.3 MB only, it was a very small uh, form factor, so there is no big uh, space you require. Also, uh, Android uh, will not take more than uh, 1 to 1.59, something like that, even lesser than that. Okay, so uh, this is very easy to install. I'm going to show you a couple of uh, slides, uh, which uh, how the uh, process goes, so that you know how the registration is taken care. Uh, fortunately or unfortunately, this is only for HAM registered uh, licensed people. Uh, why I say because uh, they have ensured that uh, unwanted people should not come and spoil uh, the, uh, the frequencies and the chat room, what they are discussing. They want some protocol to be maintained like a HAM. So for time being, the entry is only to the people who are uh, having a license, valid license. And we have to give the valid license to get a code. This code will only activate our software. Okay, I go to the next slide. Before we operate the PNET software, there are some prerequisites for the registration and get code for software to work. Okay, so there are three stages uh, we have to do. And uh, if you are already registered with uh, DSTAR and DMR, uh, if you have a uh, number already allotted by them, then you can go to the fourth point uh, straight away, download the software. On the next page, I uh, will give you to obtain a code, there is a link, you fill the form and you will get a code and once you put the code, the software will start working. Okay. So, uh, first point, one had to apply for obtaining DMR and DSTAR ID by following website. Because DMR and DSR ID is required to apart from your uh, call sign, because you when you come on a, any uh, uh, like a software radio, it has to recognize that it is a uh, coming from a proper channel and a registered uh, user. And the registered users are uh, taken uh, with a prerequisite of certain like you have to submit a your license copy. You know that is very important. So unless you give the copy, they will not register you. So unless you have a registration number, the server will not accept you. It will throw the people out. So you have to have a DMR and DSR uh, registration number. And I have given you a link, uh, the, uh, the radio net, uh, WW radio net, uh, radio ID net for DMR registration. And the third one is for the uh, DSTAR. So W6CX uh, DSTAR gateway.org stroke uh, dstar.do okay so this is the uh, dstar and the previous one was dmr 
and where do you download the software from fourth point visit windows uh, https software.palim.nl peanut uh, stroke uh, stable okay there are stable version uh, we are going to load there are a couple of other version also uh, download uh, windows software and install it and it's a you have to uh, uh, install as an administrator so that uh, there is a proper installation is possible visit uh, register pnet dot network uh, apply here to get your registering your software they uh, they will send you the code uh, see uh, even uh, two or three hours on a working day dmr dista takes maximum half a day i don't see i uh, come across five or six people who i asked them to register it has not taken more than half a day so in a matter of few hours on a working day they will come back with your number so here you have to take a once you have got all these uh, two numbers uh, then you register uh, pnet network and they will send you a code which you have to put it i'll show you on the next slide uh, where you have to insert the code uh, okay so there is a button for dmr dstar when you press it will uh, enquire query server and obtain number once above done your software is ready to go for qso by default go to english chat room and you will see many people calling with the call sign and you have qso by sliding the ptt button and you can later ask other party to qso to indian chat room as it is uh, less rush there when you chat others can hear you there is no privacy like uh, any other radio uh, and all ham etiquette supply here also so kindly maintain the decorum this platform is only for the license uh, station see when you uh, want to uh, start the software there is a english one and english two where many people land by default and uh, once you uh, do a qso you can ask the other party to move to qsi to your whatever the room you want let us say in our case india we can go to india room where you can chat uh, without any disturbance because all party uh, you cannot uh, in interfere when somebody is talking so it is always fresh so you can straight away go, get into india room also if you are monitoring india room you can straight away go there also it is up to you how you want to go first you initially you want to go to india uh, english room then qsy to uh, indian room so that is say, everything is possible a japanese guy will go to japanese room and a israel guy will go to israeli and a middle east guy will go to their own rooms uh, kuwait and all that uh, you know so there are plenty of rooms for everybody so everybody can qsy to that so that uh, they don't get disturbed and they can talk even the local language and not aligned to the uh, english speaking people so this is the uh, page you will uh, when you install this is the page you will get you will see that uh, there is a on off button there you have to slide uh, before sliding on you have to off position uh, you can set up will work only in a off position so okay like you keep it in off position then uh, you press the setup button and on the extreme right you see that uh, the uh, various uh, details you have to fill in first you uh, put your call sign then a uh, dmr id and uh, uh, us, us trust it uh, the query if you press the query button it will go automatically to dmr uh, uh, server from there it will pull the number and uh, it will show you that number and similarly for the uh, us trust that is uh, d star uh, you press that query it will uh, found and it will uh, allow you to use the software if there is a mistake it will give you some red uh, warning uh, you are not registered or you are waiting something detail so it will, you will know about it this is the third one code uh, this is the code i mentioned to you that you will go to the pnet uh, software uh, show their uh, uh, website and apply for a code and they send you a code that code you have to enter it here never give this code to anybody you keep it in a safe uh, custody rest of the things are uh, standard you know sound card if you have external sound card it will show you drop down menu so you select whatever the uh, so beep and other thing it is your choice okay you when you use the function you will see what are the type of function by ticking and unticking you can see whichever is convenient to you 
some people uh, do sliding of ptt button by default it is but if you want a space bar to activation you can do that also if you touch the space bar ptt work when you again touch it will uh, off the ptt button so if you unless you tick that uh, space bar work if you don't if you don't tick it will not work then you have to do the ptt button in the software okay so these functions you can go through everything i written uh, nicely uh, with the arrow mark so you will understand very clearly what has to be done once you have done everything uh, you will get this screen like this okay this is the time you have to uh, slide to right uh, the switch from off to right then only the software will start working and immediately you can start hearing a lot of people giving you uh, the call sign and say which room they are they, let us say i say view 3 tango bravo romeo listening on the indian uh, chat room this is the way i'll say so whoever is listening will come to chat room and he'll give his call sign uh, then this uh, screen will become red then it will show his id very good advantage is you can very well see the person who is calling you and a call sign this is one of the best uh, advantage and uh, you don't have to worry sometime to phonetics you have to use uh, to say that uh, you know then uh, it takes you a lot of time to get a right call sign uh, now here at least you have but of course people do call sign they say in a phonetic manner this is a become a practice for uh, all the ham so we will be using this will also help you so that you don't make a mistake and very clearly note down for the qsl card or whatever it is okay so you see on the right hand side down uh, this is the ptt button when you slide the button to the right the ptt button you walk it will stay until such time you release it uh, for other party to talk so uh, then you have to push it again to the left the as if you are re releasing your ptt button otherwise if you have uh, tick the box on the previous uh, menu then you can use a tab for on and off like that okay so uh, this is the slide uh, importantly uh, ensure that from off button it is uh, put to on button then only the software will work if you are doing a work and uh, you are want to concentrate and don't want to get disturb uh, simply so pull the slide to off then uh, no sound will come you can uh, work peacefully then when you want to get for queues so you can put it on again so they you also get a uh, on a website uh, this uh, this uh, page will be shown to you there is a url uh, you know uh, which uh, you can see in the software itself you can go to this uh, url uh, it will show you last here who are the people who are online with the chat room if you see so many reflectors and english room etc etc okay so here also online user who are, uh, that is the last year and this is the online user this will be more than uh, the last year so you will see who are all there present and what room they are easy to locate so that you can go to that room and do your qso and here the gateway there are uh, gateways which are ambi server gateway reflector and pnet okay and another thing this software is uh, in a real sense it is uh, some of the reflectors are connected to us reflectors and us uh, repeaters also so that uh, you going by ref certain number you can go out of the pnet uh, room to the outside world also and uh, you can do qso and this is about the, the person who has uh, done this uh, software a uh, pnet server david uh, p a lim a uh, version you have to be careful whenever new comes you update it and uh, this is ambi server you know we will uh, talk about on second volume or third volume you can there is a ambi server uh, hat available for raspberry pi and usb uh, dongle available you can uh, run your own server and connect it to uh, this am uh, pnet also so there is a process of doing that and you have to keep it on so that people you can give a free use of uh, am a server you know with that number i can join anywhere it will be easy for if it is in india it will be easy to do the qso nicely on the pnet you can talk with the ham amateur around the world one minute i'll bring it down
on the peanut you can talk with the ham amateur around the world via an android device or network radio in network radio nowadays you get uh, you know basically an android phone embedded with the rf also one uhf or vhf channel that are sold uh, 300 400 dollars also so you can run uh, your ecolink you can run your uh, pnet you can run lot of software from that uh, phone so it is a network radio and some of the rooms are connected to d star reflector the numbers is given here or dmr reflectors or talk group it is a number given here you can uh, qsi to outside world uh, by connecting to this reflector you only need an android device to use the d star or dmr the rooms like ref03 etc uh, are linked to d star you can make a qsi with your phone network radio to this reflector the rooms are transported with ambi 3000 chip i mentioned to you about this so located around the world there are local rooms like uh, spanish uh, dutch english japanese korean india etc the rooms are in a high hd quality high definition quality so the sound quality is very very good so i have done a, this uh, software there is also certain software are used for listening mode only uh, some people are insisting on uh, to submit the call sign without call sign uh, i have not checked up maybe you can check there is a android 3 uh, software like this uh, droid star uh, prx uh, tx uh, you know the uh, receive and uh, transmit hubnet uh, for all star so you can receive you know the hubnet uh, you, know, you can download you can receive uh, conversation how people are making uh, talking to each other uh, the new ham who are appearing for the exam or student they can download the software and uh, say, uh, hear the various uh, qsos uh, between two parties and they can uh, at least take advantage of that so this is uh, i'm going to play a, a, a small uh, uh, audio on this what i have recorded i play, uh, played uh, from my uh, uh, two one from the uh, android uh, phone i spoken on my pc uh, window pc i recorded this uh, conversation but the sound quality in your pc will be much 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 better because this is a the third uh, degradation so this voice will not be that good hello welcome to our uh, india chat room i hope you will allow to hear the uh, voice uh, without any disturbance in crystal clear and uh, we have uh, different rooms uh, available everybody can use uh, the rooms or panic room where you can talk on local language uh, like a japanese room in front of japanese they come and talk on the language so this is a very nice software uh, presently i am talking to you using a android uh, software and uh, this is being you recorded on my phone from my pc So the sound uh, you can see the clarity, and uh, this is very easy uh, to get registered and uh, operate within no time. It takes less than half day to do that. Any registered uh, license uh, ham user, they can use this software. I would love to see you on the other side of the uh, software. Thank you. Thanks for uh, this. so thank you very much uh, for uh, patiently listening and uh, understanding